Hello everyone, Time Fox here, and today I'll be showing you some Blacklight Retribution gameplay. This game just came out on PC and it's free to play, so there's no reason why you shouldn't be playing it now as well. Unless you have a network, of course, in which case I wouldn't bother. I mean, you could, but it wouldn't it wouldn't be a great show. Unlike this tasty SMG which I just unlocked. Absolutely beauty. I'm now a high threat and Absolutely tasty. The way this game works in terms of kill streaks is that you earn CP for every kill you get or other things such as capturing flags, etc. And then you go to a little station and then you can spawn things like this. You can spawn a flamethrower, a massive matrix style hard suit, or just about anything really. Ammo, health. It's quite nice. You also get little morale boosts for just being around, I believe. And my f first impressions of this game were quite good, to be honest. The graphics are very nice, we don't have traps running. And the controls are very tight. Sometimes the connection doesn't go in your favour. And you shoot someone for a while and they don't die. But most of the time it's really nice. You can also press V to activate thermal vision which allows you to see enemies through walls and other objectives which is quite cool there's a very heavy focus on customization in this game it's really amazing you can get things such as dice dangling off your gun camos you can even turn assault rifles into snipers so that's really tasty the only thing is though as this game is free to play you do have to pay for certain things but I think that's quite reasonable you can just earn most of the weapons on the game just through playing quite a lot. A thing that is annoying me a bit though is the um, wait in between games. The time spent in the lobby is quite a lot. I suppose you're meant to be customising your loadout but it can get quite frustrating at times. The lighting is really nice as you can see the sun almost blinded me just then. Yeah it does seem to be the case that the more you play this game the better you do because you start off with this this gun doesn't do too well. This is the gun I upgraded into a sniper and that's a mech suit which you can spawn which I believe is a, a bit overpowered, it does destroy but I believe there's probably ways of getting around it later in the game also the maps are quite nice, it's this sort of Chinatown map it's quite tasty this gun has an amazing sight I don't believe I get to use it for very long before getting shot down but it looks amazing so I'm gonna keep using it you do have quite low health on this game which means if you're trying to take on more than one guy it can be quite tricky, but I'm sure most of the PC pros can handle that. But I'm not so great when it comes to keyboard and mouse. This gun is really fun to play with, but some of the maps are quite close quartered, so having a sniper as an assault rifle isn't always the best choice of gun. But all in all, it's a great game. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next episode.